This is a CSV file. CSV is a file format used to store data. In a CSV file, data is represented in both rows and columns. The first row of the file contains the column names, and the rows below hold the actual data or records. Each record is a new row, with individual values separated by commas. That's why this format is called Comma Separated Values, or CSV. This CSV file contains my friends' names, ages, and information about where they were born, where they live now, and where they'd like to travel. Each friend has their own row in the file where information relating to them is stored. The position of the given piece of data tells us what the data means. For example, the value Seattle occurs twice in this file. In Alice's row, Seattle is the city she was born. But in Diana's row, Seattle is the city where she currently lives. The position of Seattle within the file tells us what it means. But just looking at our CSV data, it's not easy to see that Alice's Seattle corresponds to the born column and Diana's Seattle corresponds to the lives column. When a CSV is in its raw form like this, it's tough to quickly figure out which information goes with which column. Luckily, because CSV files are separated into rows and columns, they are often displayed as tables or spreadsheets. Now, it's much easier to determine at a glance that Charlie lives in Chicago, or that Diana wants to travel to Bali. Great! In practice, you can open a CSV file using a text editor. However, as we saw before, raw CSV is a little hard to read. Instead, Excel is often used to view and analyze CSVs. Excel automatically converts a CSV into a nicely formatted table. From there, you can use Excel's tools to summarize your data. If you're interested in learning about data analysis in Excel, we've got some exciting new videos coming your way. Be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out, and let us know in the comments below if you have any questions or topics you'd like to hear about because we'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching!